Hi, I'm Diane Southard, and this is your DNA News. 23andMe, one of our biggest DNA testing companies, has declared Chapter 11 bankruptcy. Now, for those of us who've been following the path of 23andMe over the last 12 to 18 months, it doesn't come as too much of a surprise that this is where they've had to land. Um, they have had some some serious setbacks in the last several months that uh, have, I'm sure, been really rough on their sales. Um, so I want to point out two things about this piece of news. Number one, it's a good reminder to us that our DNA testing companies aren't going to be around forever. And so you need to make sure you have a personal diversification plan in place, meaning that you have physically tested your DNA at multiple companies. I don't mean just transferred your DNA between companies, but that you have your physical DNA sample in more than one place. That way, if a company happens to fold for whatever reason, your physical DNA sample is still preserved somewhere in the world. So that's the first thing to remember, diversify. Second, it's to remember the purpose of bankruptcy. Here in the United States, the purpose of bankruptcy is not to fail or to go away, but the purpose is to restructure, retrench, and get back to business. And so it seems like that is what 23andMe wants to do. They still believe in their mission. They want to serve us, their customers. And this is the best way they could see moving forward to recover from some significant losses and be able to move forward successfully. So don't count them out just yet. I think they may still be around for quite some time. And hopefully they will. Hopefully they'll be able to take this chance to reprioritize and to recommit and to continue to offer a product that can serve us. So I'm Diane Southard and that is your DNA News.